Food safety issues are always a hot topic on Weibo, and while most Weibo stories are about food safety problems in China, once in a while there will be a post about food safety problems in Western countries, which some people would like to expand on to show that China isn't the only country struggling with food safety. Now, one such Weibo post is a story that cites ABC News about the recent salmonella outbreak in the U.S. According to the story, an 18-state salmonella outbreak has caused hundreds to get sick, and a public health alert was issued for Foster Farms raw chickens. The outbreak had first began in March, and due to the difficulties of the investigation, it took months for investigators to pinpoint the source of the illness. Foster Farm, however, has said that they will not recall their products because the infections were caused by eating chicken that was undercooked or improperly handled. State health officials also said that it is essential for chicken to be properly cooked to at least 165 degrees before consumption. Now, what do Chinese Weibo users have to say about the story? Well, let's take a look at some of their comments. It seems that the Americans just don't have a good immune system. I bet Chinese consumers are immune due to constant battle against salmonella. The situation is worse than I think. Americans should learn to cook how Chinese people cook and stop eating raw meats and vegetables. You can't really blame the chicken if you didn't cook it thoroughly enough. Now, who can say American food is always safe? I have read the news and found the brand is actually a major food producer in America. Without proper supervision, the food safety issue in the U.S. is just as terrible as it is in China. Before this scandal, Chinese people praised the American government and how, even with a shutdown, things are normal. But now, after a week, it becomes clear that without government supervision, things will get worse and continue to get worse. Food safety regulations require proper supervision and enforcement. To believe that companies in America will adhere to regulations simply because they are morally upright is laughable. Companies are all the same. Profit is paramount. The only difference in America is it has laws and proper enforcement of the laws to keep people from infringing on the rights of others. The lack of proper food safety laws and effective enforcement of safety regulations continue to be a big problem that many Chinese consumers face on a daily basis. Now, one of the most recent cases, according to the Wall Street Journal, occurred during China's National Day holiday. When one of China's biggest airlines, Air China, has served contaminated food, many passengers filed complaints after becoming nauseous with severe stomach cramps. However, the airline released a statement on its Weibo account that the problem was a mix-up with the food packaging, which only fueled further criticisms. Now, many Chinese internet users pointed out that a lack of accountability is one of the biggest issues at the core of many social problems in China. Now, China's Food and Drug Administration is expected to make amendments to China's food safety laws later this year, and they've been soliciting opinion from internet users as well as suggestions from China's Weibo users as well.